Good afternoon, welcome back everyone. I want to just take you through how I'm framing um, this beautiful little stitchery I received from Christine at Create and Craft with Christine. Um, I actually want to give this beautiful little piece of art the attention that it deserves and frame it up and put it on my craft room wall so I can admire it all the time as I'm stitching. And so I have a square frame that has two, two mats in it and the smallest one is 10 by 10 centimeters to fit the stitchery. But I wanna pack the frame out because the stitchery is sort of 3D. So I just have a bit of packing foam here that came in a parcel and I like to hang on to such things and not add them to landfill if I can help it. It's better if they don't come at all, but anyway. Um, <laughs> it's snowing and so I'm just cutting this up to be able to pack that board out. I'm just using a serrated knife. feel like some hairspray or something might have made this behave. I don't have any because I don't use it. <laughs> okay. I could make my own snow dome with <laughs> what's left here. Okay. And so my plan is just to place down the larger mat and then pack it out with the strips I've just cut and then my theory is <laughs> that if I have the little stitchery tucked in on this mat just line it up well like that And I use the little backing piece that came with the frame. And this backing piece And here it is, hanging up in the craft room. Glass. Look how beautifully it goes. <laughs> it's just perfect. And if I come back a little and film it, we won't get the reflection. Local birds have been very happy with the new addition. We had this visitor. We don't normally have cockies in our yard. These are our usual friends in springtime. They come each nesting season. What are you doing? What are you doing? Is that right? Did you come to visit? Hey, help off my clothesline. Help off my clothesline. What's that noise mean? And my absolute favourites to look at, the beautiful Rainbow Lorikeet. Thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.